Well, hello there. Out for another Sunday afternoon hike after church. I've come out to a, another new location for me. Harbin's Park, which is over in the northeast uh, of Atlanta area. Seemed to have some pretty good reviews on all trails, so I figured I'd come out here and check it out. But I hope I'm not setting myself up for a day of frustration because the, uh, the trail system here seems to be no definitively clear path, just a whole lot of interconnecting and crossing trails. And uh, the, uh, the all trails path that, you know, the reviews seem to indicate a lot of hike, uh, walks out in nature was having me follow along a uh, sort of a paved uh, bikeway, greenway space uh, trail. And the, the various nature trails were crisscrossing in and around it. So I am already deviating from the all trails uh, course. So that means my distance is gonna be up in the air again. And uh, I'll probably have to keep the phone out a lot just to make sure I'm staying on at least one of the tracks and uh, can figure out how to connect my way back up to my eventual destination. So we'll see how it goes today. Uh, weather is better than yesterday. No rain, uh, just uh, overcast and cool. So figure I'll be comfortable at least as I wander my way through the woods and hopefully avoid getting lost. But I'm at a T-junction here. I got to figure out which direction I've got to go. So I'm going to put the camera up, check out the phone and uh, continue on my way. Well, maybe my frustrations will be a little lessened now. I finally met up with the point where the uh, all trails course separates from the uh, sidewalk area. Uh, that was the Harris Greenway Trail. And it seems to continue on in a more linear fashion uh, outside the park. And uh, the hiking trails that time now on uh, continued the uh, looping path around the park so maybe it was just a little frustration but uh, to give kind of an understanding at the point that I met back up with the course heading into the woods here I had hiked just over one and a half miles but that was with me taking looping side trails uh, around quite some distance apart from the paved trail so i'm guessing the paved trail probably had somewhere between half to three quarters of a mile distance that you would have to traverse before splitting off and getting into the more natural terrain trail so for those who have an inclination to come out here that's some information for you but uh now i'm out in my element or officially out in my element. I've been staying in it along the way and avoiding the paved area, but I'm gonna enjoy the rest of my hike. Well, the uh, hike that I feared starting out was gonna be one of uh, continual frustration is actually turning into a very pleasant uh, walk in the woods. The trail is quiet today, but not in the lonely, isolated way that uh, my hike yesterday felt. Uh, there's plenty of sounds of nature about today. Birds and 
frogs and insects. We've seen a few squirrels scampering around. So there's just more of a sense of life and presence in the woods today than yesterday. And that makes it a much more enjoyable experience. The trail is in good shape and has uh, been easy to follow, maintaining my course. Some interesting sights out here. Came across a couple of strand or stands of uh, young bamboo, it appeared. So, as the years go by, I'm sure there'll be a much more established presence, uh, both in area of coverage and height of growth. Uh, so, be interested to see how that plays out over the course of the next several years. In fact, uh, I think we got a little bit of it here. I may be misidentifying, but uh, what I saw earlier definitely looked like young bamboo. So we'll see. You know, and what I saw earlier was a, a much larger uh, growth of uh, area. So not just an isolated clump like what I just passed. But yeah, it's a, it's a nice park, nice uh, trail system so far. I'm probably about a third of the way through my hike give or take, and uh, I'm enjoying it out here. Just past a bit of a walkway that uh, passed over a large granite shelf outcropping that uh, uh, crosses the trail and uh, runs down to the uh, river I just passed near. I'm not going to be walking along that particular river. I just dipped down to the corner of the trail next to it. We'll be having more river walking on the uh, ending leg of the trail. Seems, according to the map, looks like the uh, trail does run right alongside a river for a uh, good stretch. So I'm looking forward to that. But yeah, that was a bit of a different geological feature that you don't always get on trails like this. So. Glad they had the uh, walkway there because I'm sure in damp conditions that granite shelf would be rather slick and treacherous to cross over. But today it was easy enough to do it, stop for a couple of nice pictures along the way and continue on. Well, I don't know if I just chose the opposite direction of most people or, or what, but I'm now in the second half of the distance I'm hiking, and uh, all of a sudden I'm starting to see people out here. I uh, passed one fellow out with his two dogs, a couple of trail runners running together, and then uh, just a couple minutes ago, uh, a couple out for an afternoon's walk. So, well, there's there's hope, there's there's life in these woods. And uh, you know, I'm always pleased to see people out here enjoying nature like I am. So, 
I'm gonna continue on, greet those I come across, and see what happens. Well, I followed a little spur trail from where the uh, hiking path intersected a uh, paved area for bikes. And it brought me out to this little waterway, which runs over granite shelf here, as you can see. And uh, doesn't cross it. It just takes me up here to get uh, the view of it. So I figured I'd share it with you all. Interesting feature with the... Uh, water running over the surface of the granite like this but in a d distinct course that it is laid out and uh, don't know where it goes don't know if i'll see it at some point but uh yeah nice little feature glad to have uh, taken a little spur out to see it Getting closer to the end, I've still probably got, I want to say, a mile and a half or so to go. I've reached the point of the trail where, as I had indicated before, I'm walking um, alongside a uh, waterway. Though alongside is a relative term, I suppose. Uh, it's hard, it was hard to tell on the map, but I'm probably a good 40 or 50 yards away from said waterway. And... Uh, it is down in a pretty significant gulch um, where it's running its course. And it's not that uh, uh, large of a waterway. So I can faintly hear the sounds of it gurgling uh, as I make my way through the woods. But it's not quite the experience I thought I was gonna have. Still pleasant and all, but uh, just a difference of expectations versus reality. Uh, it's a... Uh, the, the, the forest here has a, a slightly different feel to it than uh, the uh, other half of the trail. And uh, we've actually seen a little bit more wildlife, uh, some, some deer, uh, more squirrels, and uh, signs of uh, the past, you know, horses having traveled. These, uh, a number of the trails here are mixed use of various either bikes or horses or both. Uh, hikers uh, get uh, the privilege of being able to access all the trails uh, but uh, yeah it's uh, it's been a good day I've still got a little bit further to go so I'm not going to close it out just yet but spirits are a little bit higher than yesterday's somber mood I won't say I was sad or depressed or anything just a little bit more somber yesterday today Got a little bit more life to the trail as I indicated and 
I think that's reflected in my attitude. So, I'm gonna continue on, finish this out. We'll see you at the end. How are you ladies this afternoon? Hungry, I see. This picking's getting thin out here as you get ready for winter. Well, thank you for letting me spend a moment with you. I'll let you enjoy your afternoon's meal. Be safe out here. Well, I'm on the final stretch now. Uh, the trail's met back up with the paved area. And it looks like I'm uh, following that for the uh, remaining duration, about a quarter mile or so left. So I'm gonna go ahead and close things out. It's been a good day. Looks like I'm gonna get around somewhere in the neighborhood of nine miles in, which added to yesterday gives me a nice, nice uh, total for the weekend to continue on my efforts to stay abreast of my pace for finishing out the year. Got uh, next weekend ahead of me and then uh, I'll be traveling to visit my family for Thanksgiving. So we'll see how the hiking goes in and around travel preparations and, and then while I'm away and, you know, upon my return. But you'll be here with me as you seem to always accompany me and I am very grateful for that so on that note thanks for coming along with me today and we will see you on the next trail